Hey guys, today let us discuss about anti-cancer drugs classification. So there are many subclasses in this classification. You need to remember the names of the drugs which come under the subclasses. So now I have brought many flashcards today. So here's the first one where a family is dining together. They're having a meal maker curry which is made up of mustard oil. So the mustard oil here indicates nitrogen mustards, the subclass. And the meal maker curry is me meal mechlor. Remember it like that. So meal is melphalan, mech is mechlorethamine and chlor is chlorambucil. And family has fam in it. So iphosphamide and cyclophosphamide. So remember it like a family having meal maker curry made up of mustard oil. Then comes the second flashcard where urea is available in tins, right? So urea in a tin. Nitrosoureas have tin in their name, carmustin, lomustin, semustin. So remember it like that. The third flashcard here is about anthracyclines. Okay, here's a girl uh, riding a bicycle. So my toxic Ruby has got a tumor and she is cycling. Okay, my toxic girlfriend Ruby has got a tumor and she is cycling. So my is mycins like mitomycin, actinomycin. Toxic is metoxantron. Ruby is rubicin, tumor is anti tumor antibiotics. So, let us learn in detail about these uh, classes now. So, remember those flashcards and try to recall along with me. Now, non cycle cycle specific has alkylating agents, platinum compounds, and anti tumor antibiotics. So, as already discussed, alkylating agents is al again having nitrogen mustards, nitrosoureas, triazines, and others. So, now coming to nitrogen mustards, mustard oil, right? So a family is having a dinner with meal maker. So fam, mustard oil, meal, may, chlor. So remember it like that. Once look at the classification. Cyclophosphamide, iphosphamide, melphalon, mechlorethamine and chlorambucil. Now comes nitrosoureas. Urea occurs in tin, right? And carmustin. Lomustin, Simustin. See, I have I'm highlighting tin over there. And otherwise you can remember it as in the nitrosoureia name you have S T I N hidden in it. In the reverse order, okay, you have to go backward. S T I and N. That is there in the names of the drugs also. S T I N S T I N. So nitrosoureas, it the reverse is stin. Now comes triazines. It has zine at the end. Procarbazine, dacarbazine in the end so these are triazines in the others you need to remember thiotopa and busulfan coming to busulfan busulfan uh, causes pulmonary fibrosis as its side effect okay just remember that point busulfan and coming to procarbazine it is the most leukomogenic anti-cancer drugs among all the anti-cancer drugs procarbazine is most leukomogenic whereas dacarbazine causes least radiation syndrome so many anti-cancer drugs are associated with radiation syndrome. Among those, dacarbazine is least radiation syndrome causing drug. So remember these two points in alkylating agents. Busulfan uh, is made up of alkaline sulfonates. The composition is alkaline sulfonate, so it comes under alkylating agent, right? Now coming to platinum compounds, they have plat in it. Cisplatin, carboplatin, oxaliplatin. So platinum has platin in it. Now, coming to the individual drug of cisplatin, cisplatin causes uh, nephrotoxicity as well as neurotoxicity. Okay, it damages kidney as well as neurons. So, nephrotoxicity as well as neurotoxicity. Here, a uh, question comes where uh, what they ask about the treatment that you give when this toxicity occurs while using cisplatin. And the drug that we use is amophostin, right? Amophastrin is used for nephrotoxic and uh, neurotoxicity caused by cisplatin. Now coming to anti-tumor antibiotics. I have already discussed my toxic girlfriend Ruby riding a bicycle has got a tumor, right? So my is actinomycin, mitomycin and bleomycin. Toxic is mitoxantrin. Ruby is girlfriend's name and she's riding a cycle, right? Anthracyclines. And all these together come under tumor. So that girlfriend has got tumor. So these come under anti-tumor antibiotics. So just look at the uh, non-cell cycle specific drugs once again. So you can get uh, an overall uh, idea about these non-cell cycle specific drugs. 
right so everything is discussed in detail now let us discuss about the drug bleomycin in detail right so bleomycin uh, when if ever they ask you any question like the only specific anti cancer drug in non cell cycle specific classification then you have to answer it as bleomycin because bleomycin is specific to some extent that it acts on the phase of g2m in cell cycle okay so this is the only specific drug in the non cell cycle specific classification which acts at g2m phase it inhibits g2m phase so this is about bleomycin now here this and let us discuss about doxorubicin now doxorubicin is otherwise called as adriamycin and adriamycin is cardiotoxic right adriamycin is cardiotoxic so individual drugs with few important points here and there i have discussed now let us move towards uh, cell cycle specific cell cycle specific has uh, s phase and m phase in it so in s phase there are histone deacetylase inhibitors hydroxyurea topoisomerase inhibitor and antimetabolites so there are four classes in s phase now coming to histone deacetylase inhibitors it has vorinostat and belinostat histone has no in it vorino and belino also has no in it now coming to the second one that is hydroxyurea and the third one is topo isomerase inhibitor there i have drawn a little uh, diagram where a man one man can go in two sides like two ways okay so one man can go in two sides of the road so topo isomerase one is can and topo isomerase two is side so remember it like that irinotic can and topotic can is one a topo side tinopo side is two now coming to anti metabolites there are antifolates purine unlocks and pyrimidine unlocks in antifolates there is trex in each of the drugs name methotrexate primetrexate primetrexate and etc so just remember trex and purine analogs have 6mp 60g fludarabine and cladribine and pentostatin okay so bine it it ends with bine now coming to pyrimidine analogs it ends with tabine ta is important here so don't confuse with this bine and the pyrimidine bine pyrimidine bine definitely has ta before that bine okay cytara bine gemcita bine capacita bine and 5 fluoro uracil now comes to m phase vinca alkaloids vinca has vincristin and vinblastin so vin and vin now coming to taxanes taxanes has tax in it like paclitaxel and the remaining three are the miscellaneous just remember the names erebulin estramustin and apothelon now uh, discussing about vin cristin and vin blastin vin blastin name has b in it right so it causes bone marrow toxicity vin blastin causes bone marrow toxicity now here irinotecan is to be avoided in krigler nasser syndrome just remember that point that irinotecan is to be avoided in krigler nasser syndrome because there is an enzyme deficiency which uh, uh, metabolizes this drug in those patients so that enzyme is deficient we have to avoid in krigler nasser syndrome now uh, vinblastin is having b in it so it causes bone marrow toxicity remember like that and coming to vincristin side effects of vincristin are uh, sidh and peripheral neuropathy and it causes foot drop right vincristin causes sidh peripheral neuropathy and foot drop so this is about vincristin and vinblastin in m phase uh, this vinca alkaloids plays an important role there, there are many questions asked from this topic and now coming to taxins taxins has only paclitaxel in it and uh, paclitaxel side effect is also sidh so it also causes sidh and glavan stocking neuropathy like peripheral neuropathy glavan stocking neuropathy now here uh, they usually ask about uh, the mechanism of action of paclitaxel so you need to remember that also paclitaxel has p in it so it promotes polymerization so paclitaxel promotes polymerization that means it inhibits the dis disassembly of the mitotic spindles okay by promoting the polymerization it inhibits the dis disassembly of mitotic spindles so this is about paclitaxel and uh, the drugs that are uh, classified under m phase so yeah and now uh, i think i have covered each and every drug here and 
lastly uh, this cardiotoxicity caused by doxycycline is to be treated with which drug that is dexrazoxane okay that is the drug that is that does not come under this classification that is the drug which is used to treat the cardiotoxicity caused by adriamycin or doxorubicin okay so dexrazoxane and amophostin is for nephro and neurotoxicity by cisplatin so remember these two treatments